So when we see a, a cancer patient, the first thing we want to confirm is their biopsy has been done and it's confirmed a specific type of cancer. From there, we determine what the stage of the cancer is because that ultimately dictates how we're going to treat this cancer. In general, chemotherapy that was given you know, back 10, 20, 30 years ago, these drugs were nonspecific towards treating just cancer cells. These drugs basically just were administered into the bloodstream and they would not only attack cancer cells but also affect our normal cells. So oftentimes when we see patients that have cancer now, especially in the advanced setting, our first inclination is not to jump to give them chemotherapy. We do many different molecular tests on these cancers, whether it's breast cancer, lung cancer, colon cancer, to understand their tumor biology because if these cancers exhibit certain molecular profiles, we can now give them more targeted agents or we can give them immunotherapy drugs up front. So these drugs are hopefully going to be less harmful on the patient, but more effective in treating their cancers. They want hope in treating their cancer. They want to know that they have a fighting chance, but they also want us to be honest with them. What can they expect as far as their prognosis, their long-term survival? What are the expected side effects of the treatment? Is this treatment even going to help them? And so as much as the cancer patients want to know that there's a chance that they can beat this, they also never want their doctors to beat around the bush. One of the most important things I've learned when it comes to treating cancer patients is not only do they want effective treatment for their cancer, but they also want to be able to have a quality of life. They don't want to be sick all the time. They don't want to not be able to go to work. They want to be reassured that, hey, my doctor's treating my cancer, but hey, I want to have a life too. I want to be able to go to the park. I want to go see a movie. I want to go shopping. I really just can't stress enough how far we've come in the last 10 to 15 years in cancer therapy. We are now curing more cancer patients than ever. We've had much better treatments available for patients even with metastatic disease, targeted drugs, immunotherapy drugs, these kind of drugs that stimulate your immune system to attack cancer cells. Patients are surviving much longer even in the advanced setting for many of these uh, stage four cancers.